And I've had cases where after a, a, a significant number of miscarriages, I was able to find the reason why um, actually surgically repair it and then subsequently have the patient carry a pregnancy to term. And I think not only was it satisfying, but it, uh, it actually, one of those cases got a letter to the San Diego County Medical Society and everything. It really turned out to be a satisfying case for me. I'm very serious about education. I think as a physician, you know, for a long-term medicine, uh, unfortunately, it was kind of a semi-dictatorship uh, kind of thing where you, you were uh, kind of a patriarchal kind of a, uh, you know, image and you kind of told people what to do. And obviously those days are long gone. But I think you truly need to become an educator. I think a patient should come in and have their questions answered and leave with more answers than questions at the end of the thing. And I think that's what they expect. And if not, that's what I'm going to provide them so that they understand how medicine really should be practiced. What I would like my patients to know is that when they come to see me, I will spend the time with them. They may have to wait a little bit to see me, but I will answer their questions and they will come with all the answers they need. And they'll be more informed when they leave my office than when they came in. I love what I do. I get up every Monday and I'm, I, I enjoy what I do in life. So I think, I think Confucius once says that f find something you enjoy doing and you'll never have to work a day in your life. You know? And I think that's kind of the way I look at it.